In this module, we will demonstrate how a coach would provide detailed hitting or pitching analysis after the completion of lessons. We will also demonstrate how a coach would take his completed analysis and upload it to his private Darfish TV channel to share with his players, thus removing any logistic scheduling issues with the players. A sidebar note for private academy owners, this is an excellent method to market your services. Typically players or parents of these players will show your electronic lessons to other players or parents of those players. We're going to start by opening up the Darfish application and uh, we're going to click on the library and you'll see all the clients clips in your library. We're going to find a particular client and we're going to go into the analyzer. That's the mode inside of Darfish where we're going to do the detailed analysis and we're going to drag this player's clips off of this hitting session that we're going to analyze. In this case we have five pitches that were thrown to this batter that we've captured that we want to provide some sort of visual feedback or some sort of instruction back to the player. So we've taken this swing process and we've broken that swing process down into key teaching points. These are the points that if you watch a person hitting live pitching or in a cage, you're actually looking at these key positions or key points as far as where the hitter is. So we've just used a template to create that in all of these hitting positions. Now as we go back you can see that we can draw on this with visual instruction on each one of these key positions or we can add text notes down at the bottom there or we can even add voice narration through the voiceover function. So we can provide feedback to your client through those principles, annotations, text, and voiceovers. Now we can go on to show you the same thing with a pitcher. So here's some video clips that we found of a pitcher that worked out in the cage, or in this case a bullpen session. And we've done the same thing. We've loaded those clips into the analyzer. And now that we've broken those, that pitching process down into instruction points, uh, here we're, sh we're showing effectively again that we can just play the video, slow it down. Now we're going to break it into these key instruction points. And you can see that, again, you have this pitching template that you create that, that looks at the pitcher the same way that you look at him when when he's throwing in a bullpen or in a cage. And of course we can add drawing annotations, text comments, and voiceovers. Again, things that you'll use to communicate effectively with the pitcher in this case to show him what, what he's doing right or what he's doing wrong or what you're asking him to adjust. 